num 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 no, there's no way I can voice over these sound effects. Okay. Welcome everybody. This is Jimbo Slice 23. And this is episode 39. Yes. 39 episodes. Pretty freaking cool. We are on the Ripple, Ripple Effect server, season 2. And uh, we're at my base. And I've done a lot of work. We built this house. A little Prismarine Mountain Hut, I guess. You know, we got a, we got a nice little overgrown look, which is what I was going for. With the uh, spruce trap doors, and uh, I think it looks good. Inside, we got a uh, nice little furnace, bed, and crafting table. I, I like how the furnace fits in with the little chimney. But I, I'm not completely sold on it. We might touch it up a little bit. We might not. I don't know. You know, we got a lo There's Link. Okay, Link isn't going to come for us. I was hoping she would come after us, but I think she's a little scared, you know. That's right, that's right Link. You better walk on. Anyways, uh, we have a little gift down by the portal because it is the beginning of March. And uh, let's go see what we got. Okay, here it is. This is your last box. Please subscribe again. Oh man. No biggie, we'll just have to subscribe. So this is Omni's box. Let's go check it out. Yeah. Spring break container. Wow. Conduit. Look at all those jungle saplings. That's not easy to get. Some fish. Uh, music disc. Those are always nice. Let's see what uh let's see what he has in store this this month. Okay, uh reading on camera again. Anyone else sick of winter? Well, let's rephrase that. Anyone else in the Northern Hemisphere sick of winter? Wait, let's try that again. Have you seen snow sometime in the last three months and are sick of it? We at Omni Spoils Containers have seen enough of the stuff for the year, and we need a break. And since we are very self-centered, we simply assumed that you were sick of it as well and decided to give you what we wanted to get ourselves. Little head of it. A vacation on a hot, sunny beach. But since we are too cheap to fly you out to a national beach, we decided to instead gift you with the building materials to make your own little tropical paradise. Sweet. So now you can spread all the sand around the place. Add some water and voila! A beach! There might even be a fish or two in there for added ambience. And if you want even more wildlife, you could put a turtle egg on the sand and wait and wait and wait for it to hatch just make sure you're wearing your turtle costume when it sees you for the first time otherwise you might scare it away when you can plant some jungle trees then you can plant some jungle trees that should kind of look like palm trees we think to we think to mimic the sound of the waves we suggest you put shell to your ear and mimic the light of the sun you can use the glowstone including to build included to build your permanent sun in the sky. And for an even more tropical sound, we even included a steel drum song. What a deal. Yeah. Yeah, what a box. There's all the contents. A lot of stuff. Always, always worth the subscription. Thank you very much, Omni. Much appreciated. I have an idea for the box. I need to put these turtle eggs over here by our beach area, or somewhat of a beach area, our pond area. Now, I uh, I can't get these eggs to grow. They're not growing. I've been around here doing a bunch of different stuff, and uh, the, the turtles over here weren't, um, they weren't moving, so I moved them over here. These ones won't hatch, and... Uh, what I want to do now is put a beach here. 
I might as well put a beach here. I think the I think they just hatch on sand. I could be wrong. It could be a beach biome that it hatches on, which I I don't think it does because there's turtle farms. You don't need a beach biome to put them on. So I, I'm gonna put a beach, a sandy beach here, and uh, try to incorporate it into the build. You know, maybe put our uh, sun up. Do we put a sun in here? I don't know. I don't know. This is something we're going to have to think about as we go on. But uh, we better go ahead and cut to the finish of it. Because, uh, yeah, I'm already motivated. Let's just do it. Okay, I'm back. And it looks like Link has surrendered once again. She's not going to attack us just yet. So, anyways, we got the beach done. And I'm thinking it looks... Great. Let's just throw some sandstone slabs down. I think it gives a good variation and a little more depth to the build. If we throw some down here. Hold on. Hold on. Right there, maybe. Yeah. Wait. Right. Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That looks a lot better. I think I'm done. Wait, no. Let's go over here. We don't have enough over here. Right there. Okay. All right, I think I think that looks good. Let me know what you guys think. I used some sandstone slabs and some sand stair. You know, actually, actually, this formation doesn't make any sense. Let's throw a stair there. Okay, yes, perfect. Looks great, guys. I think uh, I think these eggs should do a little hatching now. You know, we got a. Uh, we got it on sand, and I think that's all it needed was sand. I think that's all it needed. I'm I'm trying to grow turtles on dirt. Dirt uh, turtles don't like dirt. Everyone knows turtles don't like dirt. They like sand. So hopefully they can hatch while I'm over here doing a little project, and uh, yeah, they can they can just swim out into the into the pond over here. Maybe if they want to, they could jump off the cliff. But uh, hopefully they avoid the magma blocks. But what I'm going to be doing over here is we have to make an entrance and exit from this little hole up here. Because you can't just you can't just use your rockets every time. What if I run out of rockets? Well, I'm not going to run out of rockets. But what if someone in, is in here and they don't have elytra? Uh, they could use the portal. I know, there's solutions. But still we need something we need like a ramp like this i'm gonna bring it around like that and uh yeah just try to tie it in with the blocks we're using already and uh yeah let's 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 just cut to that and i'll be right back this is this is what we're going for here yeah just like i said you know it's it's just a ramp you can come up this way and uh, there's some stairs, but there's also some spots where you just couldn't put... I could, I could probably put one right there. But then you'd have to go there to there. So I kind of just made some spots where you kind of have to jump, which is like three. No big deal, you know. At least I don't think. But I like it. I went ahead and uh, did my block variations on the way down. And you can see it widens out pretty good towards the bottom. This is how I wanted it. It looks semi-natural. Now we do... First, well, not first of all. Second of all, I had some audio problems. I recorded like three scenes and had no audio. Wow, what a derp. So those first three scenes... That's me recording over, voicing over the footage. So, yeah, you're not going to... You, you, if you didn't notice, you didn't hear anything from the game going on. Just my voice. So, yeah, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. And, uh, derps be derping. But what I want to do now, third of all... We uh we wanna we wanna use this wall design I made here, and incorporate it in this ramp. You know I wanna widen it out a little bit, get some greenery in here, 
maybe have some of this uh, look like it's uh, I, I can't like stalagmites or stalactites type of look if that makes sense I don't know I mean we're gonna see it here soon but let me get to that and I will be right back with you quick little update this is what it needs to look like something like this I just did a little bit right here I did grab that don't worry about that and uh, I went along the edges right here and pretty much marked out what I want it to look like here now this is gonna be like uh, it's gonna be drooping down a little more towards the center of this you know it's gonna be from out here and it's gonna be coming in kinda of like an angle you know kinda of like that yeah I you know it, it's hard to it's hard to explain the picture you got in your head so you kinda just gotta build the picture you got in your head and that's what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up and uh, yeah hopefully it looks like I uh, picture it this is what I'm picturing right here it actually turned out very very nice I'm very happy with it as you can see we have our rock formations coming down we have our leaves coming down I threw some vines in there not many we do want to cut it off before the vines get too long but I just placed them so you really can't tell so that's finished this is finished guys I I love this right here I really really like this now we do have to put two of these in here on the other side one on one more on the other side you know we got to uh, through some leaves in there and some along the pathway now I'm going to time-lapse this we're gonna make a little you know a ramp coming down this way you know this way and this way you know you can fly through the the uh, the uh, waterfall anytime you want so and land on this ramp over here but before before I get to that I do want to show you a little more that I've done if you haven't noticed can I make my way up this way I'll never be able to make my way up here without looking so we have a boil going on at the top of the mountain oh my god glitch and uh, I want to give this a little bit more depth before I start the other ramp. I do want to, I do, do I do want to knock this out. It's here, and uh, I just, I want to fix it real quick. I want to make it look a little bit better. Maybe I can, maybe I can't. But we're gonna try. We're gonna try to make it look a little bit better. And uh, yeah, I'll be right back with another cutscene from that. And. Uh, yeah, see what we can come up with. This is so more better. We have a lot more dimension. And I went with more of like a spiky look. Because this block in my build is a spiky block. You know, we have, we have the power beam. It's like a solid crystallized block. So I went with like a crystallized look. In the middle of the mountain you know this the dark prismarine would be the liquidy substance if anything so uh, yeah this is what I came up with I think it looks really good I guess we got if you could see from the top you know we got we got a little bit more depth eh, it's not too easy to tell because it is crystallized it's crystals now they're crystals Oh, you know what? We should throw some diamonds in here. Oh, yeah. Gotta show off the diamonds in the build. It wouldn't it wouldn't be as dramatic without the diamonds. Hold on a second. We got some exposed crystal. Okay. Now, now it's complete. I didn't want to put any in the floor because you could see them 
through the bottom of the base, which wouldn't be a bad idea, I guess. But you know, we want to keep things uniform. I, I'd only ha I only have so many diamonds, guys. But I love love it now. Love the way it looks. Looks uh, a lot different, and it ties in with the whole power beam thing. So let's head down here. Sorry if you're dizzy, but uh, a twirl a twirl landing is a nice soft landing, by the way. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and get to this, and we're going to time lapse this. So just sit back, relax, and enjoy. <laughs> somewhere else right at the moment oh my god there's link there she is oh oh i knew she was here busted link i know which way to go now i'll just head down this way i'm gonna hide right here okay yeah i know where you're at link <laughs> oh i got my second account watching her go up the ramp that's freshly built like might be unsturdy okay this is where i'm currently at right now i've seen her come through here i think she's still over here i told her i'd take the cam account off just so it wasn't so it looked like i was cheating i don't know but I wasn't cheating. You guys are you guys are here. I was look, she put that back as a cobblestone. I don't know where she is now. I don't know if she left. God, she had me so nervous. I don't I think she left. I think she's just messing around. There she is. Ah, toy where there she is right there. Oh, she's coming for me now. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh my god, don't be doing that to me now. Lag. Uh-huh. Let's see if uh see if she can see me. Obney's here. Can't say hi now, Obney. I'm in a fight. Or I'm in a chase, really. There she is, there she is. There's Link. What's she gonna do? Oh man. What's she doing? She's up to something. Is she, she's has she got an anvil out right there? I think she has an anvil. Oh, she's got an armor stand. What is she, what is she doing? Okay, she's looking. Hey. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, 
What are you doing, Link? Huh? <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> making a plan. Oh, man. She's got a plan for me. Kind of a standoff right now. I don't, I'm not sure what her plans are. I'm sure it's to uh, shoot me with a bow. But she doesn't have a bow. Maybe, maybe she's just teasing me. What are you doing? She can't get up here. Oh! Oh! Oh, duds! Dad's got me! <laughs> nice, guys! <laughs> you jerks! <laughs> uh, way to go. I should have known. I should have known that Duds Duds was Link's target. Or Link was Duds' target. And, uh, man, I can't believe it took him that long. So I guess it takes two to take down a Jimbo. No. Yeah. What's this all about? Dirt. No. finished guys with the second ramp there's our first one here's our second one it's kind of smaller I didn't realize how much lower this hole was but uh yeah link came and got me whatever you know what whatever I don't even care don't even care who cares Okay, I'm pretty sorry about it, but I hope she does well. I was waiting for her and waiting for her, and she came during a time lapse. I should have figured, but I, I came out from hiding, and Duds was with her. I should have known that he was behind it. She was sitting there with no bow in shot range. She could have shot me. Just never really thought about it. I'm trying to pretty much wait for her to come at me to run and hide. But yeah, probably should have. Probably should just stayed hidden. Anyways, I if if you guys want to go see their point of view, you can check out their videos. 
But uh, that's uh, that's it for this episode. I'm running out of time, guys. I mean, I didn't I didn't expect the battle we had here. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. This is Jimbo Slice, and I have no rockets. Later. Oh, with the torch drop. Thank <laughs> you.